I you lot missing me millions. We all are. So today your teachers have got together to read Joey's story. And for this first story, we've chosen Lucy's in Lockdown by Chris Duke, illustrated by Frederica Bartolini. Enjoy. Lucy Pears hair has turned dark blue today. All she wants to do is go out and play. She's sad, angry and doesn't understand. Everyone's home and the whole entire land. She has to stay home and not go to school. Mum tries to teach while Dad potters with tools. It's so frustrating being home all day, but it's to make the virus go away. Brad is annoying and always there. He noticed the change to red in her hair. She looks out and sees the poster go by. Her hair turns green and she understands why. She looked through the window and gave him a smirk. She knew he was out there, having to work. She can't help feel jealous, angry and sad, and even sometimes a little bit glad. Thank goodness for tech, she thinks to herself. A video chat is good for her health. The phone rings and she sees Maxi Bear's face. He knows what to say, the same in this case. It's fine to feel those feelings. I feel them too. It's important to know that it's not just you. The world's going through this together. Remember, it won't last forever. Your mum, your dad, your brother Brad too. They're feeling the same, red, green or blue. Don't bottle them up, but always show it. You'll be back to school before you know it. And remember Lucy, I'm always here. Although not in person, please do not fear. And please don't forget what I always say. It's okay sometimes to have a blue day.